topic, there is a saying, proverb, in one of the early Sanskrit scriptures, which says, uh, by means of this dharma, even a beggar can prevail over a king. And of course, dharma is defined over and over again in the epics in particular in India as ahimsa paramo dharma, the ultimate law of our being, of the universe, is uh, a law of nonviolence, which of course could not be a negative law, could not be an absence, but it's often discovered in a negative way when we shun violence, when we back away from it, when we don't want to use it, we stumble upon the power of nonviolence. Of course, it's also possible that we could be in a situation where violence would be inadvisable and we abjure it, and that may or may not help to help us make that discovery, that is, because we may feel that as soon as I get my hands on a gun, I'm going to go back to violence. And uh, that usually limits our ability to discover nonviolence. Okay, so I, I think our basic point is made that uh, you can exert nonviolence even if you are in a position of political authority. You can exert it against political authority, which Gandhi said was the ultimate guarantor of democracy, that in any democracy the people must be able to use nonviolence against the abu and abuse uh, of law or authority. And incidentally,